Down syndrome is not limited to a specific population, but is more common among children born to older mothers or in isolated tribal or religious communities. In more developed countries, it can be detected long before birth, and many women choose to terminate those pregnancies. That's not the case in areas without access to special tests, and genetic defects can be hard to diagnose after a baby is born, according to Marius Linguraru, a principal investigator at the Institute for Pediatric Surgical Innovation in Washington. In obvious cases, we can just tell by looking at a, at a newborn. But in subtle cases, this is very difficult, even for the geneticist or experienced uh, dysmorphologist. But researchers at the Institute have now developed a computer program that detects Down syndrome immediately after birth. Linguraro says the technology is extremely easy to use. So you take your phone, take a snapshot, pack, and uh, the technology then will run automatically and will give us a score of, uh, let's call it severity, of uh, the child having uh, syndrome or not. The software analyzes the uploaded photo, comparing certain areas of the baby's face with thousands of stored photos, even taking into account the ethnic background. The accuracy of the diagnosis is in the area of 96 to 97 percent, which is as good as having an experienced morphologist in the delivery room. Linguraru says early detection of Down syndrome is extremely important for bonding between a mother and her newborn baby. Because that's something that studies have shown that we cannot counteract later. Linguraru also says using the new software could dramatically reduce the number of children genetically tested for Down syndrome, three quarters of whom do not have the condition lowering both the cost to the healthcare system and the emotional stress for parents. Scientists are now working on the version of the test that will allow direct access to the database from a smartphone, so any pediatrician, nurse or even midwife could take a picture and get instant results. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.